What is going on, guys? It is Chris Kringle. Join. And Adam Bacon. Yep, we are back with more Majora's Mask. We are on our way through this snowy region while our frame rate continues to die. Uh, let's check what this says. Goron Village ahead. Beware of white wolf -os. We already ran into some earlier. So, well, we should be mighty careful. Oh, but look at that. There's our favorite. Oh, not the tech tyke. Get out of here. No, it's our other favorite, Tingle. And another white wolf -o. <laughs> Eh, whatever. <laughs> you just hang there for a bit while I shoot my friend here. Again, in a different location every time. <laughs> Alright, give me everything. Tingles maps. Let's buy the snowhead one. Very good. <laughs> tingle, tingle, kulilimpa! Always love that. <laughs> Careful not to touch that ice, because then you'll freeze immediately. So. Which, thankfully, does not happen in the remake. Yeah. How come that doesn't happen? That's always confused me. Be, I guess, less obnoxious. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know, then there's no threat, though. I suppose so. Yeah. I'm not complaining. Yeah, I guess. Also, the uh, owl statue... Oh, speaking of owls. Uh, the uh, owl statue in the remake is right in front of the cabin that you saw there, as opposed to next to the wall. Yeah. You the owl. Ooh, ooh, we meet again, fairy child. Have my stone statues been of help? Well, it seems you may have the strength to change the fate of this land as I had expected. But the road ahead is even more But the road ahead is even more challenging. Many trials await you. Please watch these Gorons around you. Their land is doomed to be smothered in snow and ice forever. It will become a land where no living thing can survive. Without courage and determination, you surely will collapse from the extreme conditions. But if that courage and determination burns bright within you, then that's another story. Will you proceed? Woohoo! You are a child of many strengths. Well, perhaps you do not have enough strength to change the fate of this mountain after all. I shall take to the air now. Flying toward that shrine across the way, so follow me. Do not be daunted by appearance. Instead, let your feelings guide you, and the true path shall open before you. Are you ready? Follow behind me. It's like what the the mask salesman said. Just believe in yourself. Uh, fun fact: even if you like reset time, like after you meet him uh, for the first time and stuff, he will always say that, like we already met. Those people believe that uh, this owl is a uh, like a, some sort of spirit uh, deity or whatever, so he can travel through time like we can. Also, we are walking on feathers. Very spooky. Oh, they're disappearing! Uh oh. Uh, uh, uh. His feet are in the ground. Woohoo! I've sir. I have certainly been assured of your courage and determination. From here on, you m you must not be fooled by appearances. You must rely on your feelings. Now, enter the shrine. Something that will aid you in your quest lies within. Use that item when returning from here. Yeah, thanks. Go bug my uh my younger counterpart. <laughs> All right. Ooh, look what we got here. Chest must open. I got the thing. The we got the lens of truth. truth. Gaze through it to see mysterious mysteries that are invisible to the naked eye. See the drains magic power, all that good stuff. So yeah, basically, with using it, allows us to see through stuff we couldn't normally see, like this chest. <laughs> <laughs> Back here. And that's oh, Skulltula. Alright, you know what? Enough of you. There we go. He goes flying after that. Yeah. 
And 20 rupees. We are now max. Oh, never mind. We are not maxed out on our rupee count. So yeah, this will drain magic power from us gradually, so you want to keep an eye out for that. But, you know, it's a pretty nifty item. It returns from Ocarina of Time. But also, with using it, you can see, we weren't actually on uh, feathers, we were on uh, ice blocks. That's why we were all slippery and stuff. Also, my frame rate's dying like normal. It usually happens when you use the Lens of Truth in this game. <laughs> Oh, someone's up ahead. Oh, no. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> quick! That was a quick grab. Hello there, sir. Um, hello? Can it be? Are you able to see me? If you truly can't see me, then follow behind me. I believe even if we take the lens off, we can still see a shadow. Yep. Uh, I'm just gonna switch to Deku so I can move a little faster. You know, I don't. All right, whatever. You know, I don't think this will be necessarily the best terrain for the Deku. Uh, it's something else. Oh look, there's another Deku there. I'll keep that in mind for later. Nice. Yeah, this is a good way to just like save your magic power. Just follow the shadow. Except there are some parts that uh, require to use the lens of truth on them, actually. So. It's not entirely true. Come on, buddy. I can move faster than you. What are you doing? I thought the Land of the Dead was supposed to be fast. Alright, enough of that. Now let's use the lens. It's always interesting to see, like, what... Uh... Interpretations of different thing of ghosts, what they do when like they go through your body. Yeah. Some act like if it's uh, just nothing happened at all. Although, although some it's like, oh, you just got covered in like slime or something because they passed through you or whatever. Yeah. I don't know. I've also seen ones where it kind of acts like a gust of wind. Yeah. Like it kind of like knocks you off balance or pushes you or something. Yeah, it's a lot of weird interpretations of ghosts out there. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. All right, we good. Man, this is silky smooth, am I right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> but don't worry, this is... Oh, whoops. There we go. Yeah, don't worry, we will have... We'll let our frame rate rest for a little bit. Let's just... Get this back here. It's getting a little late out, so... Nice little golden sun on the snow. Yeah, it's actually not that bad. Looks pretty nice, if you ask me. Where is he at? Ah, oh, here we go. You can even see the little sparkles around them, so that's kind of cool. Huh. Ooh. Oh, oh my goodness. Uh, can I make it? Oh, I can't jump on there. No. I don't know how this water is You can is uh, jump on the there. rotating one. Which one? Um, to your left. The small platform rotating around that All big right. one. You know what? On the ground again. Let's just do this. There we go. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't do that earlier. <laughs> anyway, we got ourselves a ladder here that is invisible. So I believe we want to go right now. I think it's like right, left, right, right or something like that. Some, something of that nature. I don't remember the exact order. You could, I could, if you were smart, unlike me, you could just look up and see that before you start climbing up this thing. But, you know. I've only wasted enough time as it now, is. Now, if you so. look closely, the ladder's slightly off center there. Oh, look, I was partially right. And there's this guy chilling here. Literally. <laughs> this is this is the grave where a Goron hero rests. I came here to put up the great hero's memorial, but the return route has been blocked by snow and I can't get back to the Goron village. And even worse, my brother has been frozen solid from the cold. The way things are looking, I'll be frozen too. Oh, it's times like this that makes me wish I had taken some of that hot spring water I found when I was digging the hero's grave. 
But the hot spring is now covered by a gravestone. I can't move a gravestone that big by myself. But I guess this is what I meant by the Goron saying there's no use in crying over split rocks. Brr. Hmm. Interesting. Let's continue to follow. The Soaring One said the one who could see me would be arriving soon. More proof. <laughs> it seems that it turned out to be true. I am Darmani, the third, the blood. Oh, I am Darmani the third. The blood of proud Gorn heroes runs in me. This feels strange for me to say, but when I was alive, I was a renowned hero, her warrior, and veteran. Hero, yes, I was a hero. Yes, when I was alive, I was a hero. But alas, I am now dead. A dead hero. <laughs> I was fine until I marched off to Snowhead by myself, hoping I could drive off a demon. It had been wrecking havoc on Goron Village. Then the blizzard at Snowhead blew me into the valley. And now here I am. How infuriating. The golden rule, never be the hero. <laughs> As I am, I can only watch as Goron Village is slowly buried in ice. I may have died, but I cannot rest. So, you can use magic? The Soaring One also told me you were able to use it. I beg you, bring me back to life with your magic. If it is beyond your power, then I beg of you to do this for me instead. Heal my sorrows any way that you can. Please, heal my sorrows. Well, I did have this one potion at one point, but I kind of used it already. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But... Last time someone tried to raise the dead, I body tackled them. Yeah. D&D! <laughs> <D &D. laughs> I got revived from the dead once in D&D. &D. <laughs> <laughs> well, good thing we weren't in the same party. <laughs> <laughs> I leave my undying feelings with you. The deeds I accomplished while lying, living, are carved on my grave. You should read it. We ain't reading that because you got us for that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got the Goron Mask. It's our... a new... Oh. For Goron Village, I have asked your assistance. Looks like we have a new mask, and with yet another, uh, somewhat, uh, horrific transformation. Yikes. But now we are Goron Link. We can roll around with A, and if you press A and then hit B, you do, like, a ground pound. And you can also PUNCH! It tells you all this on the, uh, the gravestone, if you, if you so wish. So you can, you know, read that as you please. But I think we got the basics down. But what the guy did say is that there's hot spring water underneath this grave. So let's just get this out of the way. That seems a little weird, like, where's the grave at if it's like... If this was under it. Eh, who yeah. cares. Let's use our big, uh, manly hands and scoop up some hot spring water. So this seems like it'd be good to have. And I think it's probably time we, uh, free that one guy who's, uh, frozen here. Oh. 
You're... No, no, you're the great Darmani, are you? Yeah. Then, just whose grave was I marking? Did you come back to life because it was so warm beneath your grave? That's what I was saying, man. Alright. Great camera angle. Huh? <laughs> 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 what have I been doing? Oh, are you all right, brother? You were frozen, but the Great Dormani saved you. The Great Dormani? What's with you? Are you half asleep? Do you hear this guy? The Great Dormani died long ago and is lying in his gra- Ah! Dormani! I was shocked too, but somehow it seemed the Great Dormani isn't dead. Really? With a, this star, a, uh, with this, a star of hope appears in Goron Village. Great Darmani, please do something about the blizzard blowing from Snowhead. Jeez, needy, needy. Anyway, more magic. Don't forget to get more Spring of Honor. I know. <laughs> it looked like you were about to jump off. Nah, I was tempting faith. But yeah, we're going to get more Spring Water, because there was that pillar of ice there where those wolfles were. So we might as well melt that as well. You gotta move quick with the hot Spring Water. It's definitely something, uh... You know, can't lollygag about. Also, oh, I saw I do like the head dive. Oh well. All right. Also, with the Goron, uh, when you roll, it's like very fast travel. Uh, at least like one of the f like one of the fastest modes of transportation in the game, which is pretty nice. Because once you're all charged up, you gain all those extra spikes and stuff like that. It does drain magic though, so be aware of that. Alright. Hopefully this is close enough. And there we go. Looks like we unlocked a new hot brain water. Which is pretty nifty. And I don't think. Yeah, there's nothing else in here, I believe. Other than Deku sticks. But yeah, I think with all that, we're going to end it off right here and do uh, more stuff next time. Because it, it's night of the second day. So yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Oh damn, he avoided my punch like crazy. Do you see that? Hell yeah, I saw that. <laughs>